Hello, beautiful Pisces. This is Debs, and this is your TGIF weekly reading for Friday, the fourth of August, twenty twenty-three. And I am sweltering here in the south of France. I hope you guys have had a great week. And without further ado, let's find out what may be happening for you over the weekend and moving into a fresh week. So here we go. The deck that I'm using is the Tarot Royale by Chiro Marchetti. I'm going to be changing up the decks a little bit next month too. Uh, if this resonates with you, you can book a private reading with me. My website is in the description box below. And if you want to join the channel, I put out ad-free weekly videos every Sunday just for my members. All right, guys, are you ready? Let's find out what's going on, Pisces. Here we go. Archangel Michael, thank you for joining us. This is the weekly reading for my Pisces. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Friday, the 4th of August, 2023. What do we have? Oh, thank you, Michael. For my lovely Pisces, the cards are already falling out. That's good news. Hmm. I'm hearing someone say to themselves, I'm not quite sure what to do. Uh, how do I how do I handle this one? Okay. All right, Pisces, we'll find out what's going to be happening. Okay. Let's see what we've got. Oh my goodness, Pisces, you've got someone coming back in. Mhm. Mm okay, guys. Now, let's start with the Justice card. To be honest with you, I'm actually reading these in the way that they came out in the order that they came through, because I think somehow that's important. So, Pisces, it might be that finally you felt you had justice. You may have had issues in relationships. You had a Knight of Wands move towards you, a very attractive possible fire sign who might have been a bit younger than you. What you were thinking about was, oh my goodness, this is going to move into the Ace of Cups. But what you didn't know, Pisces, was this person was actually juggling you with somebody else at a distance. That other person could have been a Cancerian or an air sign. But this person very quickly left your life and you waited and waited and waited, Pisces, for this person to come back. You thought to yourself, oh my goodness, Ten of Cups. This person was my Ten of Cups. This person was everything I ever wanted. So Pisces, you hung on because Pisces, you may not have wanted to efface the truth, which could be that they actually left you to be with the other person. Now, the other person with the two of wands realized that this guy had been romancing you. So this woman sitting in the Queen of Swords said to this person, I don't trust you anymore because I think you are having a dalliance with Pisces and this woman abruptly left your person's life. They said, I'm not having this. I don't want to be an option. I'm leaving. So now what your person is thinking about is coming back to you, starting a new cycle with you and they're returning in the King of Wands energy. Okay. So this is someone who now is going to be wanting to put in the effort. They possibly learned a few lessons, Pisces. They're no longer sat in the Knight of Wands. They're sat in the King of Wands. But do you want this person back? That is the question. And that's what we're going to be delving into, Pisces. Now, the second deck that I'm moving into is the Tarot du Soleil, which is the Tower of Light. Let's find out what comes through in this particular deck. Let's see what we have. Yes, okay. Yes, yes, yes. All right, Michael's saying keep going. All right. Mm. So Pisces, what are you going to do with this King of Wands, huh? Are you going to tell him where to go? Are you going to give him a second chance? I don't know. We'll see. Let's have a look, guys. Well, Pisces, um, the same storyline seems to be seems to be coming through July, August time. OK, so Pisces, you sat in the energy of the sun. You were incredibly happy. You could have Leo in your chart, but you met someone that you were very attracted to. Now, it could have been a Leo, Aries or Sag, strong Leo with the sun. With a high priestess, 
you eventually use your intuition because this person didn't seem to be returning to you. You may have realized that with the King of Swords, they were actually being strategic. I think they wanted to make this Queen of Swords jealous. This Queen of Swords may not have been moving forward with them, may not have been wanting to commit to them fully. And I think this guy moved towards you because he wanted the Queen of Swords to find out. But the result wasn't what he expected. The result was, with the Ace of Swords, she literally cut him out of her life. So rather than this woman getting all angry and upset and saying to your person, oh, okay, let's move into a relationship, this woman literally left him hanging, left his life. The reason why, with the Five of Swords, she sabotaged the connection with him was actually... With the Queen of Coins, little did he know that she was in a higher level of commitment with the energy of the Hierophant. She was actually possibly married. So Pisces, his little game plan did not work. And I think now he's coming back to you a little bit tail between his legs because he wants to make it work with you. What he's not telling you is that the reason why he moved towards you before is he wanted to make the Queen of Swords jealous. He had an option, okay, to make it work with her. She wasn't moving. When he went back to her, she found out that he was having a little bit of a fling with you and she called it quits. But not because she was jealous. I think she called it quits because actually, unbeknown to him, she was married to another man, okay? All right, Pisces. So let's move into tarot. Here we go, guys. This is the Tarot of Dreams, Chiro Marchetti. Let's find out where this goes. So Archangel Michael, where do we start this reading for my lovely Pisces? Thank you, Michael. Okay, yeah, yeah. So Pisces, with the Ace of Swords and the Two of Coins, there was a strong realisation here that your person had cut you out because... He made a decision to move towards this other woman, all right? That's what he did. That's why he left. With the energy of the Nine of Swords, you may have had sleepless nights. You may have wondered what on earth was going on. I think you were very confused, Pisces. Yeah, Tree of Life, you may have envisaged all sorts of things. You may have thought this guy was actually married. I don't think he was, but I do think he was dealing with a woman who was married. The Hermit, Virgo Energy. So you sat in isolation, Pisces, feeling incredibly confused. And with the energy of the Seven of Coins, you look back at the past to try and figure out exactly what went wrong. Two of Swords. Pisces, he may have tried to communicate with you, but I think he was so angry that you might have blocked him, you might have pushed him away, said I'm not interested. Because you felt with the devil, he was simply sat in toxic patterns of behaviour. You could have connected with a Capricorn, okay? The Hangman, yeah, you weren't having this. This guy made you wait way too long, kept you in confusion, and I think, Pisces, yes, you used your intuition and decided the safest thing to do for you was to cut this guy out of your life. So that's what you did. Queen of Cups. It was sad, though, because, Pisces, you had feelings for this person, but you didn't want to be taken advantage of. You just couldn't bear it. You couldn't bear it. Magician. Virgo, Scorpio, Gemini, Energy. You thought he was being strategic in trying to manifest a third party with you. And with the strength card, Leo, you held back. You put up really strong defences. And I feel that for a period of time, there was no communication between either of you. With the Six of Swords, you moved yourself to calmer waters. You healed. You balanced your energies. Yeah. Now, page of wands, Pisces. This is someone who is going to be communicating with you again. What is this person going to say to Pisces? Okay, four of cups. He's going to say he's missed you. 
he's going to say he's not sure if you would reject him. With the Page of Swords, he's going to be speaking the truth. Now, is he going to tell you the whole truth? Is he going to tell you part of what happened? What is he going to relay to Pisces, Michael? Okay, he is going to admit there was another woman involved sitting in the energy of the Queen of Wands. And he went back to this woman. These two were connected. They might have known each other for a while. Wow. He's then going to skip the part where he finds out that she was married. And he's simply going to say to you, it didn't work. I'm single and I would really like to see you. Can we sort this out? Yes. He's going to step into the energy of the King of Wands. So Pisces, only you and I know that the woman left this guy because she was actually married to somebody else. That is the real reason why she wouldn't progress this with him. But he's going to leave that part out. Okay. What is he going to say to Pisces? Ace of Cups. Yeah. So he's really keen to get the ball rolling again with you. What is he going to say to Pisces? Five of coins. He may apologise for leaving you out in the cold. He may simply say he's missed you. He could come across as playing the victim a little bit, you know. Oh, I'm so sorry. I didn't know what I was doing. I was also struggling financially. I didn't feel good enough for you. Yeah, I'm hearing blah, blah, blah. Okay, I am. Sorry, guys. I'm hearing blah, blah, blah. You may feel he's laying it on a bit thick. You know, <laughs> Knight of Cups, he's going to be all charming, all romantic. Oh, Pisces, what did I do? I, I really balls up. I should have put in effort with you. I'm so sorry I left you. I did go back to somebody else. What is Pisces going to say? Four of Coins. I know full well that you were hanging on to another woman. What else is Pisces going to say? I actually thought with the energy of the Emperor that you were married. What is, what's Pisces going to say? That's why you left me with the energy of the fool. You jumped off, you left me and headed off to go back to your wife. What is this guy going to say? Five of Cups. No, this woman left me. We have a woman here looking guilty. This woman left me. What is he going to say? Okay, he is going to admit that he had a choice, that she had a choice to be with him or someone else. Again, Pisces, what he's not admitting is that the other option she had was to stay with her husband. What else is he going to say to Pisces? This is funny, guys. Eight of coins. Yeah, I put in all this time and effort with this woman, but she chose the other guy, a.k.a. her husband, right? Yes, he's going to say, Pisces, we had a massive fight. Oh, it was really dramatic. And she ended up leaving. She chose the other guy. What is he going to say to Pisces? Okay, she could have been a Libra with the energy of the Justice card, Queen of Swords. He may say to you, okay, well, enough about the past, Pisces. Let's forget about that. What I want to talk to you about, Pisces, is the fact that I want to balance the scales. I don't want there to be issues between the two of us anymore. I really want to spend time with you. All right. Eight of Swords. Pisces, you're going to be in your head about this. I think you're going to be pretty shocked that this guy's come back. You may have thought you'd never hear from him again. You're going to think, well, on the one hand, I had a great time with this guy. He was everything I ever wanted. But the other half of you may be thinking, yeah, he was really overindulgent. He didn't tell me at the time. He left me to be with this other woman. What is Pisces going to say? I'm going to sleep on it. Four swords. 
Give me some time, says Pisces to this guy. What is he going to say to Pisces? I am so sorry, Page of Cups. Okay. This is going to be a tough one because the majority of you will think, look, there is no way that I'm taking this guy back because he left me for another woman. Well, yes, but he's coming in. He's telling you 80% of the truth. The only thing he's leaving out is that this woman didn't want to commit to him because she was already married. It may be he doesn't want to lose face. It may be it's very embarrassing for him to come out with that. But he does want to take action. Okay. He is wanting to do the right thing now. So Pisces, you're going to think about this. What is Pisces going to do pertaining to this King of Wands? Is Pisces going to give this guy a second chance? The world. Oh, this is an elusive card. There could be some communication over the World Wide Web, the internet, right? It could be that you say to this person, is it truly over with the other woman? It could be that you say, I want a brand new start with you. Okay, let's do this. So what is the world all about? I think, Pisces, you may say, okay. There may be a quiet sense of finally I've got justice. It could be, Pisces, that you feel this guy has learned his lessons. What is this guy saying to Pisces? We'll see. The sun. Strong Leo energy. He could be a Leo or Pisces. You could have Leo in your chart. But the sun is you feeling incredibly happy. I've got to admit, the faith card. You might have hoped this would happen. You could be connecting or reconnecting rather with a Taurus. You may feel that everything's now sort of been balanced out. Because yes, he left you for this Queen of Swords. He sabotaged the connection and went back to her. But she broke his heart because he found out that she was married. So karma's been balanced. What is this guy going to be saying to Pisces? Two of Cups. So Pisces, there is a lot of love this guy feels for you. I think he realized that you two might have shared a past life with a king of swords he's going to be telling you the truth that when he was with you he did start to fall in love with you but i think he had this queen of swords in the back of his mind he ended up leaving you for this queen of swords only to be left by the queen of swords in return because she had a husband right? She was married. Energy of the Hierophant, she was married. What is he saying to Pisces? King of Coins. This is someone who really wants to put the work in Pisces. This is someone who really wants to be with you. Yes, and is coming to you to say, I want a serious relationship. I think this guy was drawn in by this Queen of Swords who actually only wanted a fling. I don't think he had any idea that she was actually married to another guy. I think then he met you and had a little bit of a dalliance with you. He may have told her, oh, I met this really amazing woman, right, or whatever this is, because I think he wanted to make her jealous because she wasn't actually progressing the connection with him. I think he wanted to get more serious with her until he realised that she simply went back to her husband. And he thought, oh my God, what have I done? So he's now coming back to you to say, oh my goodness, I feel so embarrassed, Pisces. Mm, uh, yeah, there was another woman, but she was sat in the Queen of Wands. The reason why she was sat in the Queen of Wands is that she was actually acting from a place of lust and desire, right? She was already married. He didn't know that. So I think, Pisces, you're going to take all this in. You're going to think about it. I believe that for the majority of you, you may decide to say yes. You're going to see how it goes. Because this guy has already learned his lessons, right? And if this woman is married, then there is no way that he's going to pursue her in the future. Let's see, Pisces, what he would want to say to you. Charming Oracle, Secret Love Messages. All right. What does this guy want to say to Pisces, Michael? They say, you don't know what you've got until it's gone. 
the truth, I always knew exactly what I had, but I just thought that I would never lose it. I'm sorry, I really messed it all up. Yeah, certainly did. Okay. I know that what we have is something really special. I will never find anyone like you ever again. That's why I feel so stupid for letting you go. Yeah. Pisces, he made a silly decision to leave you to go back to this Queen of Swords only to realise that she had been lying to him all along. Yeah. I'm going through a difficult time right now. I'm healing my issues and slowly becoming the person you deserve. I want to do this right, which is why I'm taking my time. I really feel, Pisces, that this is someone who is genuinely sorry. I feel this Queen of Swords broke this guy's heart and it might have been quite a while since the two of you were in contact, okay? And I think the reason why he took so long in coming back to you is he had to heal from finding out that this woman was not single. She was married to another man, okay? And he had to heal his heart. Yeah, I want to leave the past behind us and start all over with you. Okay, I think he looked back and realised that he'd left the wrong woman behind, you know? I pretend that I'm happy without you, but the truth is that I'm heartbroken over you. Mm. Yeah, there we go. I'm letting go of old ways and leaving toxic people and situations behind. I want a better life for myself, a new beginning. Now, I think what this means is he realised that this Queen of Swords was toxic. She'd lied to him. She wasn't single at all. As far as she was concerned, they were having a nice little fling. He thought that this was the woman that he might have ended up with. I think it was a very cold dose of reality and he had to heal. He had to heal from that. I'm awakening to the spiritual connection. Everything is starting to make sense. I feel relieved and also excited for what is yet to come. So now he's also realising that he can't get you off his mind because there's a very deep spiritual connection. So Pisces, all in all, this is someone coming back, feeling really embarrassed. I think he's going to really put in the effort because he doesn't want to lose you again. But it's going to be up to you, of course, Pisces, as to whether or not you feel you want to give him that second chance. So Pisces, I hope that you've enjoyed this reading. I hope it's helped someone out there. Take care of you, have a fantastic weekend, and I'll be back before you know it with your next set of readings. Bye Pisces.